so I'm Carl. I own Metal Guru and Vicious Cycles. I've been building bikes for a long time, and uh, I do more than just building bikes. So Metal Guru, consider it the parent company of Vicious Cycles. Vicious Cycles is like the house brand. Metal Guru also fabricates for other companies. So we do contract work, but I also teach classes in frame building. Okay. So I'm providing ed an educational component, maybe contributing to the industry as a whole in that way. Also, I sell raw materials for frame building. I'm a Columbus distributor. This is like some of the best tubing in the world. And then I also have a hand curated selection of small parts all personally selected by me and my ethic is that I won't sell anything to a frame builder that I wouldn't personally put into a bike because there's just enough ugly components and stuff out there I would refuse to carry something just for the sake of it being askew okay Columbus, of course, makes a full line of carbon forks as well, okay? And so we stock those in the ready-to-paint condition, but obviously from this video, you can see we also offer lots of fancy paint. Vicious Cycles has been known as like an aftermarket fork manufacturer. So we used to make hundreds of forks for a year and sell through distributors and also OEM to other manufacturers. We're actually currently about to relaunch that. So we're developing our own custom made materials to basically relaunch a modern version of our steel forks. Going to the frames. So I'm showing here three gravel bikes and we have various tire and wheel sizes. So here we have a 700C with a 40 tire, a 650B tire with 47, obviously. And then this is a 700, I think. It's a customer's bike. It's an usual bike, you've got a carbon seat tube. Very nice. That was by request of the customer. You know, I make custom bikes, so I listen to some of those requests. So this is owned by a Shimano tech rep. Got it. That's why it has the Shimano. So it has, you know, the iconic color scheme and also the Shimano logo on it. It has the DI2 XTR rear derailleur with the with the uh, Dura-Ace cranks and GRX component group. What a mismatch. No right. No but, you know, he's an outside of the box thinker. He has this big cassette, you know, working with his gravel group. So, pretty interesting. Metal-Guru.com and ViciousCycles.com.